Hi everybody, this is the Bush Gardens Junkies, and we're here at Bush Gardens today. Well, that's obvious. Duh. <laughs> hey, uh, what's going on in Pantopia? I have no idea, but you'll have to find out. Oh, wow. And, and uh, what about um, the work halls that we see around uh, the Cheetah Run? I don't know about that, but you got to stay crowned. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Sounds exciting. What about Hollow Scream? You got any info on Hollow Scream? Not yet, but we'll find out. Wow. Gonna have to stay tuned. Keep watching. Find out. that are closed today. Haven't seen it run yet. Hopefully it'll open up soon. We want to give a special, a uh, special shout out to, uh, I hope I'm pronouncing this right, Anna Greco. Uh, thank you very much, Anna. Thank you for letting us into your home and letting us bring Bush Gardens into your home. And uh, for all of you out there, um, thank you for letting us come into your homes and, and bringing the, the fun of Bush Gardens to you guys, the animals, the rides, and everything else. So yeah, a, a special shout out to Enya. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you for thanking us. So we're gonna go for another looking at the back of the train. I don't think either one of us had our eyeglass straps on. Nope. <laughs> I'm glad that they stayed on. <laughs> That's wild, wasn't it? <laughs> Over here by Iron Gwazi, they have something similar to the bush flyers. It's called the Gwazi Gliders. Along with some of the park being transformed for Hollow Scream, we have Beer Fest on its way. And they're getting that set up ready to go. I believe that starts next weekend. Yep, 21st. The 21st, July 21st. We're gonna go down under to check out our wallabies and our kangaroos. Caught one of the wallabies here. So soft. 
Are you getting a little jealous? Aww. Hi. <laughs> Ooh, food. Yummy snacks. Seagulls around here, but we do have our black swans in there. One over here and one way over there. Hey, fella, how you doing? Yep, Bush Gardens visit wouldn't be a visit if we didn't visit our pink chickens. Here we go. See you when you get back. <laughs> if we come back. <laughs> Hi, Angela. And don't get me wrong, there's more to Sesame Street than just Air Grover. But, uh, yeah, nothing that's actually good for us bigger kids to ride. Hey, how's it going? Please don't arrest me. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Are you having a great time today? Oh, we are. We are. How are you doing, Yasmin? Yeah. It's a wonderful day to be in Florida, right? Oh, yes, it is. Wonderful and hot, and that's why we're heading to Shikra. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you going to go on a splash zone? Oh, yeah. Got to. We you have to. Get that nice slow-mo video of it, too. Oh, I have. I think I got one or two of them. I did not see that one. I didn't see that video. Yeah, it was probably in, in the middle of one of them. Really? But, yeah, I'll go ahead and slow-mo it down. Nice. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, of us getting wet. Slow mo. I mean, yeah. imagine that having that one good picture. You can even transform into yeah. a picture. And then we'll just have the water just coming over exactly. us in slow motion. <laughs> yeah. Well, have a great day, Yasmin. There's still uh, the same uh, stuff that they got from before. And that was Yasmin. I still think that they're going to use a lot of black lighting here. So yeah, there's going to be some black lighting stuff going on around here, I think, with uh, some of these things here. Should be a nice, interesting scare zone. Now, the only thing that I really actually saw being transformed in this area was the pumpkins that were rotting up here. All the jack-o'-lanterns and stuff. Uh, that might be the only thing. I, I know before they had a nice little area here. With this whole area being part of a scare zone. But uh, yeah, I don't think they're going to keep this a scare zone this year. Even the bathrooms here are getting transformed. Actually remodeled at the Smokehouse Grill.
another area that's being transformed. Oops. Haunted houses, gravestones, and everything else. It's missing from the app. It's missing from the website. And the sign is missing. What is going on? So what is going on with the Sky Ride? As you notice, it no longer says Sky Ride. They've been doing a lot of work on the Sky Ride itself, but here we have that it's been taken off the app and taken off the website, and they have actually taken the signs down. Uh, so far, it's a pretty good day. It's uh, almost 12 o'clock. Yeah, actually, it is 12 o'clock on the button, and uh, we decided to stop at Chick fil A for lunch. Uh, so far on this part of the journey from Iranguazi through Sesame Street into uh, Jangala uh, through Stanleyville, there hasn't been too much that has been transformed and not that much that's different from last week or the week before. So hopefully we'll find some new uh, decorations out there for you. Uh, we are about to ride Kumba to check out the progress out in the Kumba parking lot with the shed. Now, we were told that that's where they were storing um, Sand Serpent when they took it down. But if you guys have noticed, and we'll head that way, um, Sand Serpent is totally demolished, so they may be storing the cars in the shed, but uh, we're, we're going to check the progress on the shed. Scanning platform, platform clear, dispatch.
nobody's going to squirt us? Oh well. Mom, put a dollar in there. Get us wet. We'll pay you back after. <laughs> if we see you. This is good. This is very good. Or not. Got my arm wet. That's why they say Yeah. Sink and bounce off the walls quite harsh. It's like a Oh no, oh no, oh no. 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 Starting from the Pantopia Theater. So that is the end of Sand Serpent as we know it. And uh, when I took a ride on Kumba, we saw the cars sitting in the Kumba Park employee parking lot. And uh, don't know what they're doing with that shelter, but we're gonna walk along this wall here and uh, show you all the uh, construction and see if we can't see anything else. And then we're gonna go on. Falcon's Fury and get you a bird's eye view. How you doing? Pretty good. So we have the work walls up here. No more sand serpents. And uh, well, we already know about the Phoenix is gone. Hello. Big, huge work walls. All the way. 
to the painted camel. Yeah. So yeah, that whole section with the three kitty rides and everything else, it's all done for. It's all closed up. And uh, now for the bird's eye view. Now here we go. For the bird's eye view, on all the work that's going behind those work walls. Yeah, there we go. Ah, there is no more sand serpent. And here, the bush flyers, it's kind of like the Gwazi gliders, similar. Oh, wow, look at all that work that's been done over there. Wow. And they took up that little space. Yeah. our bird's eye view uh, Pantopia and the work walls oh that's so fun oh again 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 <laughs> <laughs> again, 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 again. We are definitely riding the second time. So we can get another view of it. Yeah. Didn't take them that long to rip down everything that's over there. The Q house. The station. The roller coaster. Look at all that track that's just sitting there. scrap metal now yeah it's all scrap metal now next thing is probably that house right there or what they call the coaster barn Wonderful free fall. That was some incredible footage of uh, the whole Pantopia area that's getting all, you know, so far demolished. Uh, at least uh, the Sand Serpent area, but they did put work walls over all of the Pantopia area, uh, including the now defunct Phoenix. And also the three kitty rides there. There was a um, a train, the bush flyers, and I think it was a bush racers or something like that. Uh, something that ha with motorcycles that made a lot of noise. That's all I know. So, but yeah, those have been uh, cornered off. So. I do believe I've heard from a lot of people that one of them is actually going to be moved. So it's hard to say which one, but at least one of them will be moved. Just a magnet underneath us. They move the magnet so when it comes to a stop, the magnet helps you stop it. You'll see it when we come back. Right there. Oh, yeah, that feels 
good. <laughs> yeah. here probably working on the sidewalk and coming by the tortoises and we uh we caught jimmy here right up front hi jimmy how you doing he's poisonous no 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 just a regular tortoise very old he's like about 50 years old amazing yeah that's Jimmy and Bubba. I don't see Bubba, but... Who's there? Oh, Bubba's back there. Oh. How you doing, Jimmy? <laughs> you got enough grass from here? Okay. We decided to come the back way and see the progress on the habitat. Oh, they moved the hyenas in the first, uh, in the, uh, I guess they would call this the north, the north habitat. And over here in the south habitat, let's see all the changes that they've done. Oh, and we got hyenas over here on this side too. Does he look like he's laughing to you? No. That's either Moyo or Akita. So this is what they did when they put the work walls up. That looks so beautiful, doesn't it? Nice little bit of shade while watching our titas. And there's one of them right there. Huh? There's two of them back there. Oh, they're way back there. Hi! So yeah, this is now the uh, new cheetah 
run shading and I love the fact that they used the wood and made it made it like very natural it, it definitely uh, the shades are definitely a good addition to the park oh guess what guys yes it's been another wonderful day here at Bush Gardens hot. It, it, yeah it was definitely hot and um, well, now we are under condition red uh, due to a storm that I saw approaching from the south, I think. But back that way, you can probably, yeah, you can see the clouds behind us. So, um, so did we cover everything that you wanted to know? Um, I hope so. Uh, Again, thank you all for subscribing. Thank you for staying tuned. And uh, we're going to call it a day. So until next time. See ya.